A major mess down the shore where a sewer pipe is leaking, causing a smelly, gross situation. It's happening in Ventnor, Atlantic County. Wellington Avenue is closed between Dorset and Victoria Avenues while crews make repairs. This is a scene from Drone Watch 3. You can see a hole in the ground and the wastewater on the road. Matt Petrillo went in search of some answers. The raw sewage was first noticed flowing into the street on Sunday. The road is still closed off and it could take several days to fix the leak. It's definitely gross. A sewage leak here at Wellington Avenue in Ventnor has crews working around the clock to stop it. It's tough. I feel bad for them that they have to fix this. It smells pretty awful. Yeah, it does smell pretty bad. While neighbors walking by try to not breathe in the stench of the street sewage, Workers plan to install a bypass pipe and will also have to repair a 27 inch sewer main. We don't know exactly what happened. Rick Dovey is the president of the Atlantic County Utilities Authority. He says parts have been ordered to fix the main, but it might take at least a few days to arrive. From above in Drone Watch 3, you can see block after block, along with side streets, appear flooded with sewage water. The utilities authority insists there's no immediate health risk to people and the leak does not impact drinking water. Still, those who live nearby are urged to avoid the area. You don't want to drive your car through it and you don't want to uh, walk through it uh, or ride your bike or uh, take a kayak through it, not, which all those things people try. But some cannot avoid the area. Right now, I'm completely surrounded by. We talked to Tara right over the phone because this is the closest we could reach her since her home is almost entirely surrounded by the sewage. But I actually had to call out of work today just because I, it's, uh, I, I can't get the car out. And officials also tell us the crew plans to take a sample from a nearby bay to make sure it's not contaminated from the leak. In Vetner, Matt Petrillo, CBS 3 Eyewitness News.